welcome to another playthrough of Mechanicus from now I forgot to check what when it came out I we're gonna say 2018 um, yeah and we're gonna continue with but I forgot to mention in the previous video we're gonna be playing Mechanicum Mars Madness whoop whoop I will have to edit that in uh, afterwards yeah so we're here back at uh, day two of Mechanicum Mars Madness we have finished the tutorial now we're back at the Arc Mechanicus where we have our gathering uh, Council of Tech Priests. So we have new uh, deployment available. Right, what's this? Uh, the Killing Yard. Uh, tech Acquisitor Skywalla wishes to be in her. Uh, that's a girl? I, I thought Skywalla was a guy. Alright, that's. Uh, her research into the secrets of the Necrons and has asked for specimens of. The enemy to be gathered from the tomb of Acropis. A collection necro samples. Easy. All right, so we we can choose what missions to go on here. Uh, no. Uh, winds of change. Lector Dogmatis Vig Videx have requested the deployment at of a sensor servitor to fumigate the tomb agro lack and cleanse its spiritual corruption. Also easy. So we have two different missions to choose from. Cohort. Uh, what? Welcome to the cohort's quarters. Here you can see all the available tech priest and top uh, troop units uh, currently unlocked. Troop, un uh, troop units are shown at the top of the screen here. You can see what skills each troop has available in all and all st statistics for each unit. Tech priests are shown in the bottles, uh, bottom six slots. Uh, LMB are tech priests to begin customization. Uh, scheme. Uh, we're gonna go for Mars. Welcome to the Tech Priest customization screen. There are many ways to customize a Tech Priest. You can change their weapons, body augments, backpack upgrades and more. You can upgrade your Tech Priest, head to the Disciplines button near the Tech Priest portrait. Uh, Alright, that's there. This is the Discipline screen. From here you can upgrade your Tech Priest using Blackstone. Each discipline is focused on a different playstyle. Select one of the skills from one of the six discipline skill trees. So we have Explorator. Explorators take on the quest for knowledge more than any other discipline. They reach far into the depths of unknown space, searching for lost architect, new species and new worlds. Secutor. Secutors are masters of man and machine. They will Uh, they wield uh, the often rare trait of charisma with their <laughs> inspiring leadership. They are able to multiply their efficiency of skitar tenfold. Tex Oscillium are often overlooked discipline. The Tex Oscillium takes on tasks that other tech priests avoid. They are oil within an engine. They keep the great mechanicus cog running as smoothly as they can. Lex Mechanic, rigorous catalogers. Lex Mechanics compile, analyze, and run data entry tasks. Uh, they are capable of finding valuable data among indecipherable texts, maps, or other obscure forms such as enemy weakness in battle. Oh, this is really cool because I've always wondered the differences between these um, uh, tech priests. Engines here, unlike the other priests, 
and the Enseers are found to serve on almost every Imperial planet in the galaxy, seeing over the well-being and maintenance of uh, things mechanical. Dominus is uh, heavily trained in the art of war, using their skills to monitor, calculate highly complex battle maneuvers in the blink of an eye. Alright, so we are going for the, uh, what do you call it, conservative take on the tech priest. Uh, uh, reveal enemy stat uh, statistics when in melee range. Troops gain 1 damage, 1 for movements and critical change. Your next weapons attacks cause ignition reduced by 2 cognition points. Generate 1 cognition points in the turn if the gauge is empty. Cleanse the target of any uh, negative effects. Passive negative effects last one less turn. Uh, one ra 4 range for weapons. Alright, so what should we... Here we have to think where, how we build out this character. Should we be doing a shooter or something else? Uh, let's build him out as a secutor. In order to upgrade you must have enough blackstone. When you rank up you'll gain augment slot skills and body parts. Upgrade cost uh, 121. Alright, go for it. Having a diverse team is advised, however, the choice is all yours. Tech priests can be multidisciplined, meaning they can learn skills from, from more than one discipline. Yeah, that's what I think, that, that, that we need to... Uh, this is the mistake I made with Inquisitor, is that I made an Inquisitor without thinking, alright, what kind of discipline trees should I focus on first? Do you have enough augmented capacity to equip... Uh, this tech priest with a weapon. You can see the capacity amount for uh, items within this tooltip. Let's see, where's tooltip? Uh, is it there? Drag a weapon onto a slot using the LMB. It will take one of your tech priest augment capacity AC slots to uh, gain more AC slots. Upgrade your tech priest. Oh, is this the one? Weapons. Uh, I made him a shooty shooty. So either a Cenorite macro stubber. While Cenorite uh, equipped on its origination, witnesses the crippling effects of uh, this forbidden weapon on your enemy, whilst their voices processing within a call out heresy. Combining the raw power of ancient pattern pistols with the perilous Tenuous understanding of Necron Gauss technology, the justification for battlefield use to the tactician of the Adeptus Mechanicus is cogent. Phosphor Blast Pistol. Single target range attack deals 2 to 4 physical damage to target, acid deals 1 damage over 3 turns. Single range target attack reveals target st statistics. Deals 1 to 2 and uh, energy damage. Uh, power axe, single target melee attack. Alright, uh, we have made him a ranged weapon, but since this is a, what do you call it, a heresy weapon, we cannot use that. So he's gonna gain this. And. And this. Alright, we need... Alright. Can we buy more for him is the question. Nope. He is all right done there. Uh, next upgrade is 132. Alright. Cohort. We have Magus Jeremiah is upgraded. Let's upgrade this one. 
You want? Do we mean the other one? A shooty shooty. Uh, let's make him an explorator. Uh, since he's an explorator and he's gonna be what do you call it more uh, free spirited he's gonna be the heretic uh, heretic uh, uh, out of them so magus manarius is gonna be my her heretic then we have a servitor can't buy any more. We only have one servitor. Okay, mission. So we have two missions to go by. Either we have Tech Acquisitor Skywalla wishes to begin her research into the secrets of the Necrons and has asked for specimens of the enemy to gather in the tomb of Acropis. Lector Dogmatis Vedix has requested the deployment of a sensor servitor fumigate the tomb of. So we can get a Phosmor Serpenta, uh, we can get the Omnispecs and Blackstone. Same amount of Blackstone but different weapons. Well, I think this one has more favorable uh, gain from it all, and it's a. Uh, Purge mission, so let's go for this one. Here you choose which tech priests and troops to take on a mission. Use LMB to add a unit to the Arvis Lighter to transport. Use RMB to remove a unit from the selection. Well, I'm gonna take them all. Uh, Litany of Life, restore 5 HP to the active unit. This will, uh, the will of the Omnissiah is a strong within the prayer's canted. The priest will stop at nothing, not even death. No cantadals. Okay, so these are like uh, extra buffs that you can gain over there. Got it, all right. I called you here Lector Dogmatis Vedix because your knowledge of spiritual matters and occult mechanicus will be crucial in dealing with any moral threats on Silva Tenebris. I have five, 541,021 works of scripture stored for rapid context topical retrieval. There is no obstacle beyond my capacity to counsel you on. Unnecessary use of cogitator power, waste of resources for Videx, insufficient use, got, go to Augment Bay for improvements. The Xenos tomb is revealed to us uh, as a great hungry maw that seeks to consume our very purity. Blasphemy reeks from every corner of the tomb Agrolec. Most poetic, Lector Dogmatis, your thoughts on how to proceed? I shall take my cues from the writings of Archmagus Veneratus Hera Her Hereticus. Let the stench of corruption be swept aside by the sweet winds of faith. One of my censor servitors will cleanse the spiritual corruption with blessed, blessed incense. Then deploy one immediately. My thoughts exactly, Mag Magos. With your assistance, the Omnicise work shall be done. The sensor at Servitor is deployed at the tomb entrance, Magos. I am ready to send it on its way. Halt, Subdonema. The sensor servitor is a delicate piece of machinery. It is ill-suited for hostile territory. 
Avalonians 5.91 Fragile indeed are the tools of the righteous. It must be escorted on its sacred duty. Don't be ridiculous. Every step we take in the tomb risks the lives of our personnel. If the spiritual integrity of the mission truly is at stake, Subdonima Kepra, it's worth the risk. And I assure you, it is most definitely is. I have already sent a team ahead. I foresaw your emotional connection to your troops, Kepra. If you are ever to be a Dominus, I must show you how to command. My gratitude, Magos. The Xenos corruption will destroy us as surely as the guns of the enemy. Very well, his will will be done. Winds of change. So we have several rooms. I imagine this is uh, the end of the mission and this is the... Let's go here first. While traversing this chamber, the sensor servitor crosses the uh, part of the floor that collapses under the machine's weight. The servitor is trapped at the bottom of a shaft of a ma machinery and pipework. It must be extricated. Climb into the hole and hold the servitor out manually. Extort, ex exhort the servitor to overload its magnetic levitation circuits. Fashion a system of pulleys and ropes to haul the machine out of the hole. Uh, mechanics. To every problem, a solution lies in the application of tech lore. Thus, Farrakh as Glespian wrote, and thus we uh, we have proven. I shall meditate on this revelation. The uh, the ne Necron initiative increased. Condition points earned. Alright, so I think we're gonna... So here comes the decision if we're gonna go there, there... I think we're gonna go this way, we're not gonna go through this one, this one is the one we're gonna miss because I want to, to go explore these ones Many sh shall be ritually chastised for their maintenance failure it is imperative to get the servitor functioning again quickly Neo Dogmatics 7190. If his will will be done, it will be done quickly. The sensor servitor stops moving and starts belching pungent smoke. The runes of attention is, are blinking on its chassis, indicating several key systems require maintenance. Pri primary maintenance perform the most fu per functional rights of repairing. Perform the entire rites of refurbishment, including the incantation of seven dog diagnostic processors and an adenum fabricators. Secondary repair, perform the ritual of replacement on the servitor's key systems. Uh, tombs uh, awake level. I don't know if it means that it, when it reaches full, it will be fully awakened, or if uh, it's counting down, like how much time we have left, but we're gonna go full here. I want your thoroughness, Magus. Apophorism 97. If it's worth doing, it's worth doing completion. Ah, oh, yeah, that's uh, at warning. Our presence has been detected. Necron's awakening. The Necros are waking in, waking in response to our presence within the tomb. As you travel through it, each tomb, defense systems will start activating. This increases the difficulty of the mission. The longer you spend in the tomb, the harder your mission becomes. 
Exploring the depths of this tomb isn't without reward. There are unknown amounts of lost knowledge to be found with those willing to dig deeper. Validate. Uh, the servitor is repaired, but the process takes time. A morally questioning non-standard motivator unit is discovered and replaced. Alright, so the necros are awakening. Warning, our presence has been detected. So here comes the moral of the whole. Shall we continue risking, exploring, or should we go for the ending here? This could perhaps be the Necrons in this area, so I think we should work our way towards that. This is... This is non-standard behavior and speaks Ill's, uh, ill of the manuals whose task was maintain this machine. Maxims of Alamath. Beware the uh, 5.12. Beware the deviance of the dino own tools for the enemy finds his, his entrancy thereby. Quite unexpectedly, a previously unused voxcaster unit pops out of the servitor's face panel. It's a synthesized voice. It attempts to engage the cohort in a philosophical discussion. Alright, uh, conservator, conservative here. Continue the conversation with the machine. Perform a diagnostic on a machine to determine the source of this behavior. Rip out the servitor's voxcaster unit. Uh, we're gonna examine and then destroy. Now we're gonna be hard on this one. We're gonna destroy it because we take no risks here. We are conservative. Scanner, extract one condition point directly from a target. Aggressive uh, data mining device replaced the uh, newsware around the time uh, of the Horus Heresy. The scanner's primary function is to gather data from enemies at much fa faster rate whilst keeping tech priests at a safe distance. All right, uh, let's go and deal with this then. A glyphs. A single port designed for Necron Canotech creatures is extrudes from the device. Oh, so we had. Ooh, we have a different uh, glyphs here. Uh, let's see, this looks male and this looks female. <laughs> Not that it matters, but we're gonna go for this one. Ah, oh, goddammit, I lost two, H two damage from that. Uh, should we work our way back towards this one? Oh, this is the, the selfish choice here. Should we go for the end game or should we go exploring a little bit more? Well, I... Since we, uh, since we got here, we have nothing but trouble, but we, we need to make it worthwhile, so we need to explore a little bit. Uh, go for this one. Extra Nectrons in battle. Alright. This is no good, Magos. No good at all. The Xenos corruption takes physical form in this murky fog. Can anything be done? The noise and miasma of fumes from the Xenos machinery in this area is masking the servitor's sacred incense. Live with the miasma presence and hurry through the area. Scour away the corruption with flame. Purge the corruption with play prayer. Uh, I think we're gonna purge. Sayings of the Archmedius Cortico, verse 55, 58. Prayer has power, but I cannot deny fire does too. All 
All right, uh, since they have awoken and we have extra necrons in the battle, I think we can we can make it through the whole uh, tomb here. Magos, shut this down before the enemy are attracted to the din, but take care, do not um, damage the machine. The servitors begin emitting loud, blaring noise, perhaps a form of tampering or damage alarm that has been accidentally tripped. The noise is accompanied by flashing lights and random bursts of extremely pungent incense. Uh, silence, destroy the offending of units on the servitor, it must be done quick, uh, quickly. Ignore the noise, there is no time to deal with this problem. Diagnose and fix the errant parts of the servitor, the machine must be protected. Uh, diagnose. Alright, let's make our way towards the, the end here. Necros reanimate one turn faster. Could this be a form of Xenos map room? Most perturbatory. Uh, Frodo knows what blasphemous notions they had about the stars. This chamber's walls are covered in elaborate star shards, covering, covered in extensive annotations in the Necron language, suggesting they record journeys among the stars. Ignorance, ignore them. The intellectual pursuits of the Necrons are no interest to us. We must make haste. Interest, take pick captures of the star maps. They may prove informative. Iconoclasm, uh, destroy them. Our purpose here is to purify the tomb and works of the alien should not be suffered to exist. We're gonna, dis gonna destroy it. Your choice is a stage one, Magos. Epigraphs, Macro, Logica, Psalm 105, where, uh, where, wheresoever the Blasphemer writes obliterates. All you is take one damage, but we got some Blackstone. Alright, let's make for the ending here. So how many enemies we have? At the moment we have two Necron Warriors, so that's not too bad. I'm gonna place you at the front. Oh, do we need to destroy these two? Uh, that's gonna be the servitor's job of destroying them. There's nothing to worry about over here at least. Start the battle. Uh, we're gonna delay his turn. Uh, scan this. Reveal statistics. Oh, 10. That's a lot higher than the other ones were. So we're gonna walk over here. And then we're gonna start shooting. How much damage did it take? Should we start scanning? Oh, Blackstone! Uh, you can do a uh, reveal on him.
Well, you're gonna walk over here. Oh, that's interesting. That's some. Oh no, that's a no more Necron Warriors. I think I might have done a mistake here. Here and smack him with our uh, this one. I think we're gonna shoot him so we can kill him as quickly as possible, and then we're gonna go and stabby stabby with the. Not enough points. And it's destroyed. I think we're gonna stab this one first so it doesn't reanimate. Go over here. And then we're gonna reveal the stat of this one. Good, 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 good. And then we're gonna shooty shooty. Not enough uh, points. God damn it. Well, we're gonna walk you over here, so you're not in direct contact with the Necron. Damage. Now we're gonna go and cut the cut the, not enough points. He's gonna kill him. Jesus, I was uh, too ambitious here. Alright, let's shoot him. Not enough points. Nice, I destroyed him. So we're gonna destroy him here. No reanimation here. Can we shoot him? Out of range, no. Well, we're gonna go and get some extra points here. It might as well go and see what this is. <laughs> might as well search him again. <laughs> All right. Let's scan and hope we find something here. Go 
go and get some more points so we can uh, shoot him in the next turn. Can we shoot this? Alright, are you in range now? Out of range. Still out of range. You can't shoot anybody? And then we fall back. So we can survive for another time. points all right we fall back let him come to us and then we sh shoot him I get so scared right every time that green thing pops out on the screen like, oh no, there are gonna come more uh, Necrons now. I can't really afford that. Alright, let's go and smack him down. Can't do that. No threat remaining. Oh, we managed to do it! Mission complete. The sensor servitor reaches a location where their air currents through the tomb will take its sacred exudations to every corner of the tomb. The cohort guards it until its incense is fully deployed and can escort it back to the tomb entrance. This is only the beginning. No aid from the Omnisaya. The sensor servitor has been delivered from the depths of the tomb. Lector Dogmatis, its sacred incense now permeates all areas in the structure. A positive outcome, Magus. It's right and proper that you see, as I do, the dangers posed by the corruptive influence of the Xenos. It remains to be seen if the tomb is rendered less dangerous for our troops. Uh, at the very least, the place is less malador uh, malodorous. I will. Tr uh, I trust you will uh, co continue to consider the alien with hatred and disdain they deserve, Magos. As we explore this world, remember the words of binary hierarch Getsemore. The weak in mind will seek to understand the Xenos. The strong in mind will destroy them and bless their ignorance. So, we lost the conservative uh, Magos here. About the time, 9 minutes. We increased it with 5%. Killed 3 Necrons. Lost. New Canticle unlocked. Complete one mission without using a Canticle. Uh, the ne next physical attack will deal free physical damage. Though they flee and cower from us, the unrighteous shall find nowhere beyond our reach. Alright, now we need to buy some more. Oh, we. Uh, oh, they, they, he's still alive. Oh, thank the Lord. So we don't lose our cohort. They're still here even though they're dead. Ah, that's what permadeath means. There's a play for where when you lose a character. He will, he or she will not return. All right, so phosphor serpenta, 
Uh, single ranged attack uh, wheels target statistics deals 4 to 6 damage. A favorite weapon among the many ticks priests if the target survives the initial trauma then they are soon felled by the light guided volleys of their follows. Alright we're gonna give uh, our I'm gonna give him this because Oh, you can't uh, you can't do that. We need more uh, slots to give him a serpenta. Gersh's data mind device cooldown. Shall we give him this? Ah, so you get a service skull or you get Dominus Pex carries a raptor class machine spirit capable of reading heat uh, and biological waveforms in extreme range. Upgrade. You can upgrade him more. All troops in range attacks uh, selected targets. Can't do much there. Cohort. Uh, I want to buy some more servitors. How do you do that? All right, let's go back to the mission then. So we have either Skyvola. Tech Acquisitor Skywalla wishes to begin her research into the secrets of the Necrons and has asked for specimens of the enemy to be gathered from the tube of Acropis. Install a system of Vox casters to transmit prayers throughout the tomb of Agralech. Videx believes this will dampen the Xenos tainted tomb. It's still easy, but we have a flayed one, can uh, Canoptech uh, Arcan Rites, and a Necron Warrior. Reward will give another Servitor. And retractor field. This is still easy. This was gave us an Omnisign axe, curation, and blackstone. So this is more worth it because we need more servitors. So we're gonna continue with the Videx. Sorry. Well, we're gonna deploy them all again, I guess. Deploy! The potential for corruption in the tomb of Agrolef continues to vex me, Magos. The spreading of the incense was not enough. I fear not, Magos. The malevolence of the Necrons is overwhelming. Observation on the Tech Cosmos verse 6 to 8. We are derelicts in our duty whenever we allow corruption to play the minds of good men. Then what do you suggest? Our progress in the tomb makes it possible for us to install a system of vox casters in the structure. And what would that achieve? Uh, lingua Technics prayers could be transmitted to the very heart of the Necron's resting place. Our troops would uh, go everywhere bathed in the sacred binary of the Omnissiah, sayings of the Princeps 654 when the de Tao dis deserest uh, to discourse purely use binary. A novel concept, Lector Dogmatics. I have considered your plan, Videx, and co a cohort has been deployed to the area. I have personally selected the prayers of purification and translated them into broad spectrum binary. Once the Vox casters are active, the tomb will ring to the Omnissiah word. I have the Voxcaster's locations plotted, Magos. I am still uncertain if this is worth the risk to our people. Uh, 
One in pos uh, possession of augmented emotional centers cannot appreciate the benefit of this operation. Galfalmalorians 45.7 Above bullets, above blades, care for our soul above all. Your concerns are noted, Kepra, but you have your orders. Yes, Magos, his will will be done. So here we go for the end goal. So we're not gonna... Oh, we have two plots here. Uh, so I would recommend that we install Voxcasters here right away just to... Uh, Cause I was too uh, cocky in the previous round. We're gonna be more careful this time around. Cut the front battle servitor armor. Not quick, thick enough. Castellan proving equally ineffective, must find weaknesses before we connection lost. It appears this Xenos form triggered a fragmented re recording from Rezak. Indeed, it appears we'll have a tough time using heavily armored forces against this specimen. Maybe we could use their strength against them. Wise words, Dominus. Survive three rounds. So we... I would suggest that we do a hit and run here. So we're gonna place you at the furthest away we can. Or wait, we're gonna place you over here so you can get some action points. I'm gonna move down here and uh, stay away from the canoptric ancranites. We can perhaps get take on this. Might be able to destroy this one eventually. Start battle. Start moving down here. Everything is out of range. However, you can reveal the stats of this one. Oh, we should have revealed this one. That was stupid of me. Alright. You can reveal the stats of this one. Eight. That's not too difficult. But it depends on how high his uh, armor rating is and such. Is he in range to be shot at? Out of range. Also, we don't know how high his uh, attack rating is. And here comes the flayed one. And a new Necron Warrior. What is this vile mix of flesh and machine? Is this a form of Necron in its infant state? What has Skyvola got to say? Uns Unsurety statement loaded. Unsure of life form progression path. Diagnosing, diagnosing possible outcomes. Signs of degradation. Deformed segmentation. And physiological deformities. Possible solution. Infant disease. Parasitic life form that represent form of ripped flesh, should I continue? That's enough Skyvola, I believe we are not the ones who diagnose ne Necron Health, but instead be their executioners. I am all mostly concerned for, for my troops morale, there have been reports of Skitari disappearing in these tombs and I believe now I know why. 
Guitar Lies Architect STC Fragments Missions. Oh, so he preferred this one. <laughs> How supportive of you, Redditus. Alright, now we have a Servitor. I would suggest... Flayed ones are... We're gonna go for the... Um, the, the warrior so he cannot shoot. Yes, we're gonna keep it like that. So, you are able to shoot now, so we're gonna shoot this one. Well, let's go and uh, deal an uh, attack on this. Oh, we're out of uh, elimination, that's bad. Opportunity. He really went for that one. Oh, we destroyed it. Alright, uh, you're gonna start by shooting this one. And destroy it permanently. Oh, he's getting more cognition points there. Oh, here comes another Necron. Kill all enemies. Alright, first of all, you're gonna attack this warrior so he doesn't reanimate. Then you might as well go over here. Gain some initiative if he tries to attack. Uh, enter. Try and shoot him. Oh, we have we. Oh, we had already checked that one. Well, check this one then. Uh, let's see. I think we're gonna fall back with the, our troops. Let them come to us, especially now that we're damaged. Almost dead there. Let's shoot him. And fall back. Really want to scan this. Warning, our presence has been detected. Move on and attack. There. These are canticle these are the canticles available to use on this mission. Canticles can only be used once per mission, so keep it there in mind there might be more fights to come. Uh, rest uh, restore 
five HP to an active unit. Uh, the will of the Omnisable is so strong within the priest uh, that the priest will stop at nothing, even death. Uh, we're gonna use this one. Should we use it now, actually? Oh, we should have used it on a on a priest, but now this um, servitor will survive for a little bit longer, at least. Let's go over here. God damn it. And now he's a sitting duck there. Well, you have to go and kill this one now. Not enough action points, really? Really? You're gonna destroy this one? Go up and take some uh, heat. You're gonna fall back. You're not gonna die today. Scan this. Is that one still alive? Alright, we need more action points and we gather them over here. So that's where we're gonna fall back. We're gonna go and get some action points for us. All right, can you shoot him now? Out of range, of course. Well, let's go and stabby stabby. Two damage at least. You're gonna go and get some action points. And you're gonna stay there for now. He's gonna die now. Uh, 
but you are now in range to be shot at. Now we just need to destroy that one too. Yeah, give us that action point, please. Out of range, of course, of course. Well, you're gonna shoot this one so he's not a problem later on. a little bit. Let that one come to us. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Go into battle. we lost. Mission failed. This mission is abandoned with the Voxcaster network still inoperative. The binary prayers are never transmitted through the tomb of anger or death. Instead, only sounds are the gunfire and screams as his guitar continues to struggle against the awakening necrons. Formulae Technologica versus 427 cursed be silenced when the Omnisaias word should be ring out. This setback will be redressed, Wydex. You shall have your cleansing of this world. It will not be as rapid or simply as simple as hoped, but that is all. I pray you are right, Magos. Speaking of which, I must need the rituals of atonement for our failure here today. Oh man, I feel like a complete failure here. Well, I think we're going to end this for today. So thank you much for watching this. See you around, everybody. Bye-bye.